Hey guys, what is up? Dave here coming back to you with a brand new video on the channel and today's video, of course, today's video is going to be about the 2.05 update for 1320 challenge. With this update comes back 120 FPS by basically unanimous uproar of the community. I'm so sorry about 90 FPS, please forgive me. I was just, eh, we'll leave it alone. <laughs> it's in the past, we'll leave it alone. <laughs> uh, the other things that are in this version is sound is always enabled, so you can no longer lag your ETs with sound off. Yes, we know there's other ways, but we do have the auto files in place for cars and such anyway. As far as other things that have come to 1320 Challenge, there's just some small visual stuff like this where it says current version instead of the actual version number. Not a big deal. But one of the biggest changes that anybody will notice that was unanimously voted on by the community is the ability to do 1320 Legend style bracket dial-ins. That's right. You can now run your slow cars again and actually have the same advantage as running fast cars. Because, you know, as popular member of the community Sonic pointed out, if you are running a bracket car for you know on the older 2.04 version you can dial in 9.999 and have the advantage because then you'll if you run a 10.000 you win by 001 but if you have a 10o car and you win with a 10. Dot, you're missing a whole nine thousandths of a time that somebody could potentially beat you by but as you can see we can now do legend style bracket dial-ins and now slow cars for bracket are just as equal to fast cars for bracket which is awesome to see now as far as sound being enabled across the game client the game client always has sound enabled there's no way to turn turn it off anymore even if you come in here and spam this button it does nothing also if you even do find a way to turn it off, all the code in the game client for checking if sound is disabled is removed. So even if you did get it to turn off, it's not going to make a difference. And with that came a side effect of things being a lot smoother. Even on, you know, 90 FPS, things were smoother just because of it. But lights are smoother. Oh, God, this is the wrong dial in for this car, but that's okay. Lights are smoother to come down. The RTs, it seemed to remove um, a good majority of having lag RTs, which are like 0 0.533, 0 0.517, 0 0.567. Those lag RTs don't happen as often. I'm going to say as often anymore. Now, there's always going to be people that find a way to lag cars and make their ETs faster. That's just a thing. It's going to happen. You know, everybody's going to look for their edge and play really close to the rules. But, you know, that's gaming. That's racing. Everybody's going to do that. So, hopefully in the next future update, we are working on some really cool ideas. Like, for example, figuring out a way to put wheels on the Nitto stock car. That was something I was working on pretty heavily. And I realized you basically just have to remake the whole car wasn't fun i tried really hard to get it in this version for you guys because it looks really cool for it to have wheels on it it really freaking does but you know we'll figure out some stuff for the next update i'm sure and come back to you guys you know what really bothers me the wheels that you can see inside of there's no brake rotors everybody here is racing like jesse in fast and furious every single person y'all ain't got no brake rotors rotors I wonder if I can fix that. It'd be really cool to do brake rotors and then make the caliper the same color as your car paint. That'd be sick. Or even just control it by graphic color. That'd be sick too. But anyway, guys, <laughs> that's enough. I need to stop talking. Uh, that's the 2.05 update. 120 FPS. Sound is locked on. Bracket dial-ins. Oh, the biggest... I forgot one more thing. You go to an online race. I want to race Brett. In okay, he's on that. Oh, he does have a TFD. I knew he did. I want to race Brett. Heads up. I want to go big money. I'm talking monster money. I'm talking, I want to show my baller status. You remember before? 
We had to do like one E6, and that would be one million because you do an exponent, which is basic math. Oh, no, 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 no. You can now race for mills. You can race up to nine, 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 nine. You can race up to a dollar short of 10 mil. You can race for mills in 1320 Challenge. I am so excited. Somebody, please, race for some mills. Throw them in the highlights section. I want to do a rich people tournament. I'm not a rich people. I got $219,000. I'm not a rich people. I want to see somebody do a million dollar race. Post it in the highlights. We'll boost it around. I'll post it on social media and stuff, and we'll blow it up. Uh, uh, try to get it to go somewhat viral, and we'll use, you know, give you the shout out to your socials and stuff like that, and we'll go from there. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll talk to you guys later. I got to go. As you can see, it well, you can't see, but it's midnight where I am. I want to go to bed. <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.